Welcome back, guys. Okay. Now. Credits. And, uh, yeah, I'll talk a little bit over this. Uh. In terms of, uh, gameplay and whatever. Uh, first let me say, you know, this game was... Obviously, since I'm titling it as Final Fantasy 2, this was actually the second Final Fantasy game to be released in America. And it was the first one on the Super Nintendo. Um, none of the games really took advantage of the Super Nintendo's capabilities until much later on. Uh, but I think this one was pretty good in terms of uh, graphics quality. It was pretty good. Storyline wasn't bad. Uh, it was... I don't know, it, it was kind of generic, and the way they sort of threw the underground and the moon in afterwards, sort of, it seemed a little bit cheesy. Uh, it seemed a little bit cheesy to, you know, just to extend the storyline. But, um, having watched uh, other people play through uh, Final Fantasy 2 and 3, the Japanese versions, from being Final Fantasy 4, I, I understand where it comes from. Standalone basis, if you're looking at this Final Fantasy 2, this was a huge leap from the first one, and it really set the stage for um, future games, which would be Final Fantasy 3 for the U.S. would actually be Final Fantasy 6 in Japan, but I'll call it 3 since I'm talking about the U.S. Final Fantasy 3, this this game that I just played and just finished that you're watching the credits for was really a good springboard for it. They um, they got a lot of graphical elements down, they got a lot of storyline down, learned how to work with the uh, system, and uh, make some interesting stuff out of it. What would I have done uh, differently with this? Well, I don't know. I, I much more prefer the style of Final Fantasy III, um, American Final Fantasy III. I much, more, I much prefer that style to this one. Um, the game controls and the artifacts or relics or whatever, I prefer that much more. To this one and there was a you know a lot of espers and everything in this there's a limited number of spells in both but I think there's more in the next in Final Fantasy 3 better way of learning them and there was more interesting storyline in Final Fantasy 3 I think uh, each character had their own story really that contributed to the whole of the the experience of the game um, and there were also points where you, your party would split, you'd have three different scenarios or whatever to play out in Final Fantasy III. I like that much better. Um, and also in Final Fantasy III, it wasn't required to have all the characters to finish the game either. So that was an, another interesting touch. But really for its time, Final Fantasy II is a great game. It's uh, got great playability. It's a hell of a lot of fun. And... Uh, the American version is the easiest, so if you're going to try playing any game in the Final Fantasy series, uh, Final Fantasy 4, uh, actually Final Fantasy 2, sorry, for Super Nintendo, the U.S. release was actually a good one to start with for uh, anybody who's interested. So anyway, that's the end of Final Fantasy 2, the end of this uh, big Let's Play. Uh, probably took around 50 parts, 52 maybe, I don't know, I haven't actually put them up yet, so I'm not sure. But, uh... Yeah. Don't know what I'm going to do next. I may just do some small Let's Plays. I've had a couple people request uh, Final Fantasy IV Advance. Uh, I've never played it. I don't have an emulator for Game Boy Advance or anything, so I'm not sure about that. But, uh, yeah, I'll be, I'll be looking around. If you guys have any comments on anything that you want, want to see me Let's Play, anything you know that'll drive me nuts that you'll probably get a kick out of me getting angry and possibly beating up on the desk or uh, giving up and throwing a hissy fit, giving the game up, whatever, feel free to uh, toss those out and, uh, you know, I'll consider it. Um, it's a lot of fun doing these and I really enjoy them, so uh, either this or any computer games I can get a hold of. I love Super Nintendo games. They are my favorite system. But Genesis 2, you know, if there's anything, I was thinking about doing maybe Boogerman, but I really suck at it, so I don't know. But, um, yeah. Long and short, if you want me to do something, toss me a uh, toss me a message. Tell me what you want me to do, and I'll see if, see if I can do it. Check the feasibility of it. Otherwise, guys, it's been a pleasure bringing this one to you. Uh, hope you all enjoyed it, and I'll see you around the bend for the next Let's Play.
Until then, slow mojo punching out. See ya.